Let's say I want to insert a sound file onto this close activity. The first thing you need to do is save the hot potato into a folder and make sure your sound file is in that folder as well. Also make sure there are no spaces in any of the names, the name of the hot potato file and the name of the sound file. You can insert a sound file anywhere, in a question, in the reading text. All you have to do is make a space for it, use insert media object, browse for it, it warns you that you must have the file saved in the same folder, find the file and double click on it and then all you have to do is use this bottom bit include simple link and go OK and then I'll give it a little space and see what it looks like so I'm going to save it and then what I'm going to do is use this export to create the file save it in the same place and let's view it now when you view it outside of Moodle you'll just see a link so let's put it into Moodle and see what it looks like so I'll add it into topic 7 here click add an activity or resource hot pot add you can either give it specific text or get the text from the actual item now here's the clever thing go to that folder so make sure you grab the htm file and the mp3 and drag them both over and drop then once they arrive click on the htm and set main file then go down and make sure that the filter is on. So I change that to Moodle's standard media filters and go down to the bottom and I'm going to save and display so I can see if it's working. There you go. So when you press that it'll start playing.